I'm taking a selfie. Pillow talk. Hey guys, welcome back to Pillow Talk Monday. Um, it looks a little different because I've been getting, personally, so many requests that people are like, I want to see Adriana closer. Like, <laughs> I want just mainly Adriana's face in the frame. And sometimes it's fun to switch things up. And this is our show, and we could do what we want. Yeah, it was looking kind of uh, busted. <laughs> I think the bulb in my light is dying. I think, it, like, you didn't see it. Yeah, I think yeah. I need to switch this, this, the bulb. The bulb was slowly getting darker, darker and darker and darker. <laughs> and today we wanted to be very close and personal with you guys because we're going to be going through each other's old Instagram photos. I only have, like, ten photos on my Instagram, so... So it's more embarrassing for you because... All your photos are recent. Maybe. But we're going through them. I'm going to pick one for Sarah. Sarah's going to pick one for me. And then we have to explain, I guess, what's going on in that photo. Basically. Or just try and figure out what's going on. I think that's so the point. Old. Yeah. Okay. Oh, also, like, real quick. This is how, like, um, millennials and people that use cell phones, like, use cell phones. Where, like, they'll swipe with one hand. They're like, oh, let me go into Insta. Do you ever notice old people, when they use cell phones, they hold it with one hand <laughs> and then they use their index finger? And they're just like, they just have never used a phone before. Hitting things. I'm like afraid of it. I love it. Okay, I got one. What kind of rich white girl bullshit is this? So in this photo is rich Sarah with her gaping wide open mouth holding a brand new PS4 and a brand new <laughs> Xbox One. And her caption is, I'm bad at making decisions. <laughs> Okay, first of all, this is a classic Sarah face. This is a classic Sarah face. Um, and my mom actually worked at EB Games for like a hot second. The most well-timed hot second ever because she worked there when all the new consoles came out. So mm -hmm. she just got those for free. Okay. So my captions got, I didn't really have to make a decision. You well, no, one. I did because you know what? The Xbox is at my mom's house and I took the PlayStation. This? is the braggiest photo I've ever seen. Okay. Okay, well when your mom gets cool perks, you're allowed to brag. <laughs> I guess so. So this is the third <laughs> third thing I've ever posted. So this is a heart stop sign and her caption is stop in the name of hashtag love for people looking up that hashtag. But the funniest part about it, it's so blurry you can't really tell, but it's food trucks in the background. <laughs> Adriana loves food. What's well? What's, let me explain yeah, okay. first of all why it's so blurry. The back of my phone had broken, and so I went to like Chinatown to get it fixed. And I didn't realize that the new back had like a plastic filter over top. So I was oh. taking so many pictures with this plastic filter over top. So that's yeah. why all of my initial Instagram photos are blurry. Oh my god! But I don't know. That was at Nathan Phillips Square, downtown Toronto. There was like an art show. And you just really... I really like that sign. It, it was, was the a, sign, not the, yeah. not the food truck. Oh, I ate at the food truck after, <laughs> but I didn't need to take a picture of that. Just so many selfies. Okay, I like this one. So this one's a selfie of Sarah, and it says, caught in the rain, hashtag curls, hashtag goodnight. And like, it looks like you styled yourself for a good hour. And this was not, oh, I was caught in the rain. It looks like you specifically, you know, put your hair... You took a photo in front of a mirror. This is probably the hundredth selfie you took. I know this isn't like a one shot wonder. Um, and you look like you're really high. I didn't style it. Mm -hmm. That was just... You I didn't mean, maybe, style it at maybe all. Maybe I like... I find that hard to believe. <laughs> look at this face that you're making. <laughs> Um, and I wasn't high, but it was very late, so I was probably drunk. Yeah, you're definitely drunk. Yes. And I remember if you... I like the, like, a, slightly open lip. See, it's in a series. The four, the three photos before it are the same night. Oh, so yeah. So it started a bar. But you can see that your hair got that's curlier. That's a bathroom. Yeah, so you can see. And that's yeah. where we went when it was raining. So this is, like, this is a so 3 a.m. It's like a 3 a.m., like, legit walked home in the rain selfie. Okay. Okay, while I'm looking though, can you explain like why your handle is man I am no Sally? Um, my favorite photographer is Sally Mann. Uh, her last name is M-A-N-N. -N. Mm. And basically it's just a play, just on, a words play on words that man I am no Sally and I will never be as good as Sally Mann. All right, I got. Yeah, I'm. I have a theme. Okay. Going. So this one is literally just you. It looks like you traveled in a storm. 
with this hat and this jacket. And it just, the caption is, I love hashtag pie, again for people, like, searching the pie hashtag. And you're, and you're holding four pies. Yeah. This photo was taken at the Big Apple, which is um, a store. They just sell stuff made with apples in it, and they have the best pies ever. And I don't go there that often, and I wanted to buy Stop apparently that. all of the pies they had. <laughs> Sarah likes to do this thing where she, it's called fake walking. <laughs> Sarah will do a bit, take a picture of me, but she doesn't want to stand there, so she pretends to walk. But because she's pretending to walk, she holds it, and it looks fake as shit. So this is one of Sarah's very first fake walks. It's famous. I bet they never knew that it was fake until now. I think it's pretty obvious <laughs> that this is fake. And so the caption is, hurry summer, I heart jean jackets, hashtag Canadian tuxedo. Maybe you have to explain what a Canadian tuxedo is. Oh, it's And explain why you like fake walk. <laughs> I think people know what a Canadian tuxedo is. It's where you wear jeans and jean on top, jean on bottom. Mm -hmm. I mean, this, I mm -hmm. think I've mastered the fake walk. Cause this- This is the first one though. This is the first one, so. Obvious. I was just clearly trying to show off how gay this outfit was. That is a jumble fuck of an outfit too. Okay, so this one is Adriana feeding birds, which okay. literally just looks like a picture that belongs on like my mom's Instagram or like my grandma's <laughs> Instagram. Like it's not even like an exotic bird. <laughs> Just it's a, like a, a sparrow. dirty Toronto bird. Like a dirty little Toronto bird. You're like, <laughs> I'm near a sewer. I have some bread, and I'm gonna feed this like dirty little sparrow. And it's hashtag midair. Like, <laughs> like, like again, like, like she's doing, like she's doing some Jordan jump, and she just is like has to brag about it being midair. But it's not even midair. Like it was swooping down at her. It was clearly just standing on the ground. <laughs> This little fucking bird was literally like eating bread right out of my hand. I I'd hold it and he'd the jump picture. up and he'd eat it. Yeah. And I probably that was probably one of a set of 300 <laughs> photos. All right, so if you guys want, you could follow us on Instagram. Also, we have a gay women channel Instagram where it's just going to be a lot of photos of the two of us. So if you a really want to like see us together, but then if you don't and you want to see us separately, <laughs> you have but options. But then we still sometimes take photos together yeah. in our personal ones yeah. as well. So just follow all of them. Yeah. And if you guys haven't seen Almost Adults yet, it is available on 24 VOD platforms and all the links are in the description. Just have to shout that out. Also, we are gonna be at Playlist Live this year in Orlando. Uh, we don't know what we're doing yet, but we'll, we'll be, be there. there. Yep. And you can come say hi to us. But not if you haven't seen Almost Adults. Don't show your face oh at my Playlist. Oh god, don't even think about it. We will quiz you. So watch it more than once. It will be hard. It won't be like, who are the main characters' names? All right, thumbs up if you enjoyed looking at our old Instagram photos. And leave a comment with um, which photo out of all of those photos was your favorite. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Thank you for watching Pillow Talk Monday, and we'll see you next Monday. I think oh. we're gonna do that now. I think oh, we're gonna blow, cause we're so close. blow kisses. Okay, and I'll suck it back in. There are like lesbians and stuff, and straight the straights that are on these cards, Yes. and you can actually play this as a game. One gay or bi person or queer person, and then one straight person, and then we have to decide if we would trade that gay person's sexuality yep. so the straight person could be gay. To make your ultimate gay to team. To make my ultimate gay team. Okay, so, are you ready? So yes. here we're going.